Well, okay, so I'm not gonna lie. Actually, nah, okay, so here's the thing. I didn't, I, I kind of did expect this, but I didn't expect this to be today. I thought it would be like September, so it makes me wonder. <laughs> See what I did there? Wonder. It makes me wonder, are we going to get a Nintendo Direct on September? Since this, this is coming so close. My guess is yes. We haven't got, we've, for the past 10 years, for the past decade, we would always get Nintendo Directs uh, in September. So the fact that they're putting this out now in the end of August, we might get two Directs within the ne the past, the next couple of weeks. Uh, I don't know, that remains to be seen. Um, but again, Super Mario Brothers Wonder, what am I expecting? Obviously, we're going to be seeing gameplay, new gameplay, um, new ca um, gameplay elements. We may see that message that they've been teasing with you know miyamoto and charles martinet charles martinet you know regarding the new voice actor for mario luigi you know and all that stuff um i'm assuming the vo voice actors are going to be the same for the rest of the pe people you know diana mustard daisy daisy's going to be playable that's so crazy I, I i i'm really excited to see i don't know what to expect but uh it's going to be starting any minute now so it's gonna be pretty exciting pretty exciting this is one of my hot this is one of my highly anticipated um games and all right here we go welcome to the flower kingdom a not so distant land just beyond the mushroom king oh yes Mario absolutely were invited here by the benevolent prince florian Plince Florian, okay. The king of the Koopas had other plans. The classic. With just a single touch. The classic the Bowser. Wonder Flower. The Wonder Flower, which is basically the... The Wonder Flower with the ability reminds me so much because it distorts reality and stuff. Oh, no, we mer merge with the castle. Okay. Because it reminds me a lot of uh, Phantom Ruby. With, uh, with Sonic. Okay. All this music goes hard. But of course. Ooh. It's literally warping reality as we know it. Which that's really cool. Chaos spread across the land. It makes me wonder. Now it's up to Mario and friends to Is Bowser really in control? Kingdom. The Flower Kingdom, yep. And look at a lot of the Yoshis. And Daisy's playable. Yep, Mario, Luigi, yep, yep, yep. The fact that, oh, Daisy's playable. I can't believe it. We'll go over what's new in Mario's latest 2D side-scrolling adventure, the Super Mario Brothers Wonder Game. Let's yep, the Super Mario Brothers Wonder Game. Okay, so they're in a new kingdom. kingdom. This is a new kingdom. It's made up of six distinct worlds that circle the Petal Isles. Ah, six. Okay. Areas to explore. Okay, so Petal, so it's seven. Okay, that makes sense. Pipe Rock Plateau. Yep. Of course, the Ice World. Fluff Peak. Fluff Puff Peaks, yep. Many trials away amidst the picturesque scenery and radiant cascades of interesting. Okay, so it's like sand. Dive into the sea. Yep, Petal Isles. Yep, water. Yep. <sighs> Everything looks so animated and stylized. I, I love it. This is. I felt this is what Mario needed with the main series games for like the longest, like longest time. So I'm glad it's continuing because it started with Odyssey. But a rich variety of courses await in each world. Look at the personality with like Mario and how he moves the animations. It's so cool. You can even yep. walk freely through open areas you find. Yep, that's cool. Yeah, that's similar to 3D World. Yep, of course. Any order you like. Any order. Once you've played a course, you can quickly come back to it through the courses menu. Oh, okay. I like that. I like that. Uh, quality of life. Quality of life. While in courses, you might notice some talking flowers. Yeah, the talking flowers. Close and onward and upward. How'd you get up here? What a pretty sunset. 
Ian Sinclair? Uh, no, it's not Ian Sinclair. The voice actor for the for the flower. Yeah, but Daisy! Daisy's playable! Besides Mario, you can also you can... play as Luigi. Yep. Peach. Yep, Peach. Daisy. Yep, Daisy's playable. One of two toads, yep. Oh, Toadad as well. They all play the same. So go with your favorite or mix it up. The Yoshis and Nabbit, on the other hand, won't take damage. They're a great choice if you're looking for a more easygoing experience. Interesting. Okay, so they're basically easy mode. If they fall down a pit, so watch your okay. Interesting. Okay. Can flutter, jump, eat objects, and yep. Spit them back at enemies. Yep. Speaking of That's cool. Things, here are some of the new ones you'll find. Copycats will copy the player. So if they all play the same, that, that that's a little bit of a because I would have assumed that at least at least Peach and Daisy would have the ability to float, you know, just like Mario too, or at least or Peach at least. So I guess that's a little bit of a disappointment there. Yeah, I would have loved at least, uh, very least, Peach and Daisy would have the ability to like float. I see. Yeah, that's, that's that's a minor thing though. I guess Nintendo didn't want to alienate other players. I don't. Oh, new power ups. Oh my god. The Yeah, the elephant Mario. That's funny. I like it. So is it gonna be the same for for all the characters? It's gonna be specific, just for Mario. That's cool. And yeah, it makes sense because he's so big. That try. <laughs> Yep. The toads. Oh my god, and Peach and Daisy too. Peach, Daisy, and <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> forms as well. Oh wow. Okay, so they all have element elfin forms. Oh bubbles, okay. Oh that's cool. That's cool. You can take care of enemies surrounding you in one go. Defeat typically impervious foes. Oh, that's actually really good. That's actually really good, and you can kill them from a distance, too. That's actually really, really... Ooh. Okay. Okay, I can see that being one of the more powerful power-ups, for sure. Definitely. Drill? Drill the pit, drill to pierce the heavens? Is this the Gurren Lagan power-up? <laughs> this is the Gurren Lagan power-up. This Kamina approved. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I like this though. This is really cool. You can even burrow into the ceiling. Oh, that's cool. I like that. You can even burrow into the ceiling. Oh, that's sick. Wasn't expecting company. The classic fire form. Of course. Yo, fire Daisy. Yo. In fact, this Daisy's gonna have so much, so many different forms with all these new power-ups. Wow, he's happy. <laughs> oh, Diana Mustard with the new voice acting. I love it. Oh, man. Oh, this is looking so cool. Wonder Flower. The only gripe I have, uh, the only small gripe I have is like Peach and Daisy won't be able to like float like in Mario 2, but this is a small, this is a small, small tidbit. That would have been nice. Yep. Zao World, though. This is gonna be a video. Wonder Flower versus the Phantom Ruby. I love how random and chaotic this is. You can end up in a free fall. I love it. Oh wow. 
Oh, wow, really? Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. Float through space? Float through space? There are even wonders where your character transforms. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> that's so random. Oh, a Goomba. Oh, no, that's... <laughs> that's funny. Oh, wow. Yeah, becoming random... So basically, the wonder the, the wonder flower is like oh, <laughs> balloon. Collect a wonder seed, and the course will return to normal. Some courses. So basically, it's like is is what is it like randomly generated or no? Is it like is it like different for each level? That's what I'm wondering about. Is it different for like each level? Okay. Nice badges. What are these? Adventure progresses. You'll unlock in-game badges that change up the way you play when equipped. Ooh. There are really? Badges, each with its own special ability. Oh. Slow your fall with a Yo. Equipable abilities? Jumping abilities with the wall climb jump bag. Yo, that's okay. This is sick. Speed while underwater by equipping the dolphin kick bag. So you unlock abilities. It's like a skill tree from for 2D Mario. Charge up a bounding leap with a crouching high jump bag. Oh, that's sick. Oh, that's oh, that's sick. That's really sick. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, that's sick. Safety bounce. This is up They basically added a skill tree for 2D Mario. That's like a skill tree for 2D Mario. That's sick. There's different abilities you can get, you can unlock. Yeah, that's sick. That's sick. We've never had. Oh, that's sick. I, I love that. Oh wow. That's sick. I love that. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Oh, it's per course too. Or when starting a course. So there's so many di different ways to play the play the course as well. That's sick. I like that. I like that. Some badges can be earned by clearing special badge challenge courses. Okay. This encourages like like a like replayability, like with that with the, the abilities alone. Like so many different ways to like complete the courses. Play together. So this mean online local co-op okay up to four people can play locally on the same Nintendo switch system okay but Pick your favorite character and jump into the adventure together okay but like can you do online though their character will float around the course as it goes if another player reaches them before time runs out they'll jump right back into it okay <laughs> the ghost mario <laughs> that's so funny it's like <laughs> you can jump on their back and ride them around yep that's cool that's cool also playing as a yoshi that's fine really <laughs> what the fuck? yes online play okay on the world map and in courses okay but can you play with them though these are people from around the world enjoying the game in real time appearing as live player shadows okay so local co-op if you're defeated you can come back to life by bumping into a live player shadow okay players can send greetings and share okay that's cool that's cool okay so you won't be playing together directly You'll get to experience a subtle connection with other players online as you enjoy this new adventure together. Okay. You can also place a standee in a course. Interesting. Okay, so there is online play, but like not in the traditional sense. Not so easy areas and help your fellow players. Interesting. Okay, so it's Okay. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, so it's not in the traditional sense, but or their standee. You'll see their username and heart points. These points show how much they've helped other players on their adventure. Okay. I think that that's that's different, but that's at least at least some form of online play. I like I, that's cool. So you're playing with them in real time, but like not directly. That's interesting. Okay. And you can interact with them too. That's interesting. Okay. Okay. 
In the shared room, you can see which courses your friends are playing, enter courses together, and even race through certain courses. Start okay. The race block. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so you are put. Okay, I like that. I like that. That's sick. Okay, you can make a room too. In some courses, you'll need to grab a wonder seed or defeat a boss instead. Okay, I like that. Okay, so you can make rooms as well. That's cool. I like that. That's really, really cool. Yep. Yeah, for races is too. Okay. That's cool. I like. I like that a lot, actually. That's really cool. <sighs> With the different abilities as well, the skill tree abilities you can like unlock. There's like so many different ways to play. That's sick. Like, that's so cool. I wonder if we'll get to unlock like a float floating ability. That not that that. Well, I wonder if that's one of the abilities. <sighs> that's so cool. So many different ways to play with the abilities alone. <laughs> you can play online as well. That's sick. Uh, okay. Okay. That's really cool. I love it. Oh. A new a new Mario OLED. That's sick. I love it. Oh, that's so that's okay. I like that. That's cool. October 6th. Oh, wow. Okay, so that's, like, sooner. Okay. All right. And, and, yeah, there it was. Okay. So, yeah, so a lot of things to break... A lot of things to break down. Uh, We'll break them down real quick. Uh, Yeah, I'm really cool. The, the one thing I was wondering is if there is going to be online play. There is. There is absolutely going to be online play. Um, But, yeah, so we, we're going to we're gonna get that. So, yeah, so I want to I wanna break this down. Number one... Number one... Uh... As a reminder, uh, Daisy's playable. <laughs> Sick. In this presentation, it's among the tubular hills of Pipe Rock. Yeah, so I just want to do this. Yeah, so I just want to do this real quick. Um, yeah, the, the levels look really, really crisp. Obviously, I also want to I want to point out as well, like the the um the animated expressions uh, the fact that the mario characters the game in general just looks this expressive and animated the style is really really nice i love it um a lot of elements with um the overworld similar like 3d world um yeah then we have the talking yeah so the style the stylization of this game is incredible um, the fact that you can play as so many different characters, and apparently with Yoshi and Nabbit, with Yoshi and Nabbit, like you, you cannot, you cannot take damage. You can, you cannot take damage. So it's kind, of, they're kind of like easy mode, in that. <laughs> hold on. So they're kind of like easy mode in that aspect, uh, which is cool, which is, which is interesting. But obviously Yoshi has his, uh, has his flutter kick, and then he has uh, his, uh, his, his swallow ability, and then like Nabbit. Funny enough, is also playable, um, which is interesting, which makes sense. Yeah, so if initially at first, when obviously a lot of the characters are going to be playable, obviously, you know, with Peach and Daisy. At first, when I heard that Peach is wasn't going to have her float, it's like, oh, uh, okay, I would have loved it. But now that I'm seeing that, you can equip different abilities. Like, you can equip different abilities with that. With uh, each each um, each character uh, that you choose, uh, and I'm like, okay, okay, I like that, I like, I like that. So I wonder if the float ability will be available. I wonder if the float ability will be available as an unlockable like ability, like an un un unlockable like equipable ability, which should be very very interesting. Oh yeah, and Toadette's playable as well. Yeah, so a lot of playable characters. But I, I guess I can also see why they opted to just have... Yeah, so Yoshi has his abilities, and then the rest of the characters, like, play the same. Since uh, a lot of them are going to have equipable abilities. I don't know. I would I would have been interesting. If... if, if I would have been fine if, like, a Peach and Daisy had their... Had, at least had... At least Peach had her float to, to start with, but... 
That's fine. There's unlockable abilities that a lot of allow for different different ways of playing, which I am completely fine with. I am completely fine with that. Yeah, and the enemies are kind of enemies are. I love how new and fresh the designs are. Of course, Goombas are gonna be you know the classic enemies. Um, I'm gonna be really curious. Also, really curious to be at the post game as well. Okay, so. Yep, so here's the thing. A lot of people... Okay, so a lot of people thought that um, the elephant ability, which looks cool, by the way. Which looks insanely cool. Um, There's so much utility, so, so much power with it. Just look at that. But here's the thing, though. We originally thought that it was going to be just for Mario, right? A lot of people thought that. Well, apparently, uh, that's wrong. Because not only Mario will be able to do it, Luigi can, and all of the others. Yeah, Toad. <laughs> look at that. Toad has the ability. And look at Peach. Oh, Peach looks so cute. It looks so cute with that also. Which means Daisy's going to have the power up. And all that stuff. And just look at that. The power up, was, the power up itself is really, really cool though. It's like... <laughs> so much utility. So many things you can do. And it's just really, really cool. This is really, really cool. <laughs> oh my god. Toad, to elephant toad looks so funny. Um, but yeah, and the bubble. Now, the bubble ability for Mario, look at that. Yeah, all bubble blowing babies will be beaten senseless. No, not Mario. Not, bu not, not any of the characters with the bubble ability. That's so powerful. The moment you get caught in the bubble, you just die. Death by bubbles. You never would have thought about it, but death by bubbles. The moment you get caught in those bubbles, like, you just die. Look at it. And you can pop on them, too, for, like, mobility. But, like, it's, it's, it does a thing. It's, like, the moment you pop, you moment you get caught by the bubble, you die. That's just crazy. And look at the drill. The drill to pierce the heavens. The Gurren Lagan power-up. The Kamina-approved power-up. And you can and you can go down as well. Just look at that. You can just you can go down as well. And you can just like burrow, and then just you can literally. I wonder if you can attack from above too, uh, like from from or from the like from the ground probably, but like yeah, like that's just so cool. That's just so cool. And just look at Daisy. Daisy's gonna have so many abilities now, cannon abilities, which include. <laughs> <laughs> which include like the oh my goodness which includes like the elephant abilities just so many i'm glad daisy's getting like the proper love that she deserves just look at that it's gonna be so great um and not only that the sheer amount of replayability with this game that it's showing uh, online and just especially with all the different abilities as well it's gonna be very very fun that's gonna be very, very fun, especially with the with the online, and the fact that you can play with your friends online and get to play with friends with like all play with people all around the world. Not directly, but it's like it's kind of in a sense of similar to how um, with Balloon World, with Mario Odyssey, with Bl Balloon World, because with Balloon World, um, basically how it works is you play you you post a balloon. And basically, you get to you reach that person's balloon the fastest time, and the faster that you reach it, and depending on how uh, how difficult the balloon placement is, the more coins you get. So that's kind of similar to that in a set, but like kind of like evolved, where you're playing with the players in real time, but just obviously not directly. But you get to meet them in real time, which is really really cool. Yeah. Now the wonder effect that looks unpredictable as all hell. It's like. Literally the Phantom Ruby, but like more like like the Phantom Ruby, but like on steroids. Well, it's similar to Phantom Ruby. It's like reality is just shifting to like the unpredictable like ways. It's just so cool. Also, I wonder if Rosalina is going to be playable like in a, as in like an unlockable character. Uh, I don't know. I think it would be cool if like Rosalina was like playable in like a 2D Mario game but uh i don't know i wouldn't maybe i don't know if there's gonna be dlc but i don't know we'll have to see but yeah so the badges oh my god look at the badge so the badges 
the fact that you can equip different abilities is really, really sick. It's like, it makes me wonder as well. Like, I wonder if there's going to be, like I mentioned earlier, they mentioned earlier that all of the players, all the characters besides like Yoshi and besides Yoshi and Nabbit, I believe they all play the same. Um, so, but there's different abilities you can choose, um, which is really, really cool. And there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine abilities, which are yet to be shown off, which I'm curious as the, the, the I wonder if the, the float's probably going to be one of them. My guess is the float's going to be one of them. Um, it'll probably be for all of them. not just peach it, not just peach and Daisy, which would be really cool. So, but this is cool. There's so many different possibilities with just the like unlockable abilities as well, which is going to be really, really cool. So many different ways to play with these. And it, that encourages like, um, replay that just adds to the replayability of this game alone. And I'm not talking about like online, but like off, like offline, but like online as well. There's so many different ways to just like, just like play. There's so many different possibilities, along with the new power-ups. Oh, the grappling vine looks so fun. The grappling vine looks so fun. And the safety bounce as well. You're literally just saving yourself from, from death. And the sensor abilities, looking for different power-ups as well, with different, like, items and abilities. That's really, really cool. The coin magnet, especially if you want to... There's so many different ways to, like, play. There's so many different power-ups. And the jet run. You don't stop running, but you run really fast. <laughs> Which is really cool. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so overall, like this is looking really fun. This is looking extremely fun. And the online. So basically... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Wait, 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 Look at <laughs> Yoshi's strong. Yoshi's strong. <laughs> oh, look at Yoshi! Just looks. He just looks so annoyed. He just. Like <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, I almost got a cramp. <laughs> I can't. Alright, but anyway. Last thing. The online play. Oh my goodness. So basically, yeah. So it looks like the online play. It seems like um you're playing with them. Playing with everyone like in real time. So you're not playing with them directly. But it's like you're playing with playing with them in real Like the player's shadows. But they're in real time. Like you're playing with them in real time. Which is really, really cool. Um, and I think that's a good, cool way to handle the online instead of like, you know, hey, uh, you have to wait, for, wait for lobbies to play with people. It's like, hey, you're going to be playing with them in real time as they're going through it. So as they're passing through, which is really, really cool, which is really, really cool. And if you want to play with people, you can set up lobbies to play with people. So it's like, yeah, that's, that's, so that's really cool as well. I think that's a cool way to handle the, ha handle the online again, similar to like balloon world. From like Mario, from like Mario Odyssey, but like fully, fully, fully realized. I think it's really cool, and you can interact with the people with the people in real time too. I think I think that's a really cool way to handle it. And uh, yeah, the heart points, yeah, it, that's gonna be really, really fun. I think that's a really fun way to handle it. Damn, yeah, Mario Wonder is gonna be really, really sick. Just overall. And with the online capabilities and the fact that you can actually, you know, you can play with, you can play with, you can create rooms and all that stuff. You can create specific rooms. That's really cool. And you can look, you can search for rooms as well if you wanted to, it seems like, which is, which is nice. 
I, I miss I missed that before. You can do friend races too. This is basically racing to the finish. Yeah. And this is sick. This is sick. I, I think Mario Brothers Wonder is going to be a must get for the Switch. Tor I know it's towards the end of the Switch's lifespan, but it looks like it's going to be uh, a must get for the Switch. Easy. Easy must get. If you want to get the Nintendo Switch, uh, yeah, Mario Bros. Wonder is looking to be pretty, pretty staple. Which is really, really cool. But yeah. Uh, overall, I'm excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. This is going to be this is gonna be a hit. This is going to be really fun. Um, of course, I'm going to be playing as Daisy a lot. Because even though she isn't my favorite my favorite princess, I've been wanting her playable in a mainline series Mario game. Like a proper one. Not like Mario Run, but like... A game like this for like how long? And now she's finally got... I'll be playing as Daisy a lot. And as Rosalina, if she, if she is unlockable, which I don't know if she will be. Maybe. I don't know. But she was unlockable in Mario. <laughs> she was unlockable in um, Mario uh, 3D World. So there, there is that. But uh, yeah, overall, this is pretty sick. Uh, I can't wait. Uh, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. If you liked my reaction, if you liked me um, commentating over this, if you liked my pretty little face, which is, it, it's not really, it's okay. It's kind of mid, but like, yeah, yeah. You, you, you get what I'm talking about. But yes, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, Y'all have a nice day. This is going to be sick. Um, Mario Brothers Wonder coming out in a month with the new uh, OLED switch coming out like, oh, like sooner than that. Like, that's going to be sick, though, because Mario Wonder and Sonic Superstars are coming out on the same day. On one hand, I'm like, okay, kind of sad for Sonic Superstars because it's going to cannibalize. <laughs> it's going to a lot of the sales is going to get cannibalized by Mario Wonder. Um, but at the same time, it's like, yo, Mario and Sonic at the same at the same week. And they're all really good, like 2D 2D games in their own right. Oh, it's going to be it's going to be fun. It's going to be so sick. Like, I can't wait for Mario Brothers Wonder. And Sonic Superstar at the same time. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait. It's going to be a fun, fun week. But anyway, with that being said, y'all have a good day. I'll see you guys later. Take care. Buh-buh.